Trash Turbo Kit on here. This is strictly for the love of the game. We put a Redshift 468 cam in this thing. What's up guys, we're here at the Tour Custom Cycle Shop, right in front of this 2022 Lowrider ST El Diablo. They just finished doing a trash turbo kit on here. This thing looks crazy, it sounds insane. It's crazy. Tell us about the trash turbo kit. Uh, purpose, so, what does it do uh, as far as install, is it easy, is it not? So the, the uh, trash turbo kit, this is actually a new kit um, that's offered for trash. It's sold through Drag Specialties. It's called the Trask Tornado. So you can't go directly to Trask and get it. It's a Drag Specialties exclusive. Oh, okay. So the, the ones that they sell for these like look a little different. The I, I think the piping's a little different. Um, the pipe but looks this is a great kit. I mean, everything you need to put this thing on is here. Everything. So what what is um what other numbers that they're telling? you that you're gonna be getting out of this. Uh, Cause I know everybody wants to know, what's the numbers? We're being told uh, 100, around 160 horsepower to the wheel and somewhere around 160 foot pounds of torque. So okay. we, we took trash recommendation. We put a Redshift 468 cam in this thing because basically when you build a torque like this, you want a low end torque cam because the torque is going to start giving you your power at the bottom end, okay. and then the turbo takes over. Gotcha. So you don't want anything that's going to come up in the high revs, gotcha. really, because that's what the turbo is there for. Okay. Uh, so this is the exhaust right here? Right. So what, What's this? Is a breather or what? So that's the wastegate. Okay. Um, when, when you're building up all that pressure in the turbo and it's forcing it into the motor, when you get off the throttle, and you seal off that butterfly, that air has to go somewhere. So it'll, it makes its way back through the turbo and then it'll come a little bit back through the piping and blow off out of the wastegate so it doesn't bind the turbo up. Cause it'll actually, uh, somebody, you don't want it to spin in reverse. So is it like a, like a secondary version of an exhaust in a way to get rid of the dirty air or? No, it's actually, a pr it's like a pressure relief. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, because you could gotcha. damage the turbo without that being on there. Install was pretty straightforward. I mean, it comes with uh, its own cam cover. Nice. And this cam cover has oil lines that uh, come out of it and feed the turbo. And then out of the bottom of the turbo, this is your oil drain. So it drains the oil back into the cam chest. So the boost gauge, um, the way that they have, they come with a bracket to put it up on the handlebars. But since this bike's got the Kraus T-bar set up, um, it would just, it would, it would take away from that. So Trask makes it a bracket. So we're going to sit the boost gauge down oh, here off okay. the air cooler. Nice. Turbo is going to run about 8 pounds, uh, 8 PSI out of this one. Um, that's safe without changing engine compression and things like that. As far as install, how, how long does it, does it take to install this? Um, this was our first one, so we took our time with it, about 10, 11 hours. They say that you can get them done in eight. I'm sure okay. the next one we'd be able to get done in eight. Nice. Now that we know all the ins and outs of it. All right, and then I'm pretty sure everybody wants to know, uh, final cost, when it comes to doing the, uh, the turbo trash kit on here. All right, so I'm pretty sure everybody's gonna wanna know, what's the price on, on this, if anybody was to buy it? Okay, so if you wanna come and buy this kit, it runs, retails for $59.99 um, for the kit. Now, plus... There's a whole lot of cash, man. Well, there's more. Okay. Because this, uh, Trask works with the Max. Trask works with what? Thunder Max. Okay, so only with the Thunder Max? Only with the Thunder Max. So you need to, you need to buy a Thundermax and 
Trask provides the tune for it for the bike. So that's you're looking at another thousand dollars close to with the Thundermax. Oh, okay. Right, and then and then you got your eight to ten hour installation. And then he went ahead and also got camp as well. Yeah, we did some extras on this one. We did the 468. Well, you have you don't have to, but you're kind of losing the experience without the cam. So the 468 cam went in this. We also went ahead and did solid push rods. Um, we did fueling race lifters. We did star racing springs. So we, we kind of strengthened up the motor. Um, yeah, that Trask says you don't have to, but you know how we do things here. We, we always strengthen the motors up. And, I mean, it's, it's only right that you guys get to see who, whose bike this is, so we get this show you right now. This is, from what we know, this is the only El Diablo with a turbo on it. Come on, come on, man. This is Anthony. What's up, everybody? This guy is the, the brains behind the operation. Uh, so this is his bike. Well, why did you want to do the whole tris, uh, turbo kit on there? You know, it was from the bike builder I had a little pressure from. Knowing that it's launched, it just came out this year. Uh, Mike was really on top of it, making sure that I knew what was going on, where it was, and how we were gonna get it. It's something special for me, because for purchasing the El Diablo, I'm already 1,500 made like mine. Yeah. And to, to really stand out from the crowd, and when I say the crowd, I mean the world, it's, this is what we're gonna do to make it one of one. Um, it's not a race bike. This is not something for competition. This is strictly for the love of the game to ride with my boys and uh, keep a smile on your face. That's right. So you, you guys are, are gonna be seeing a lot more of, of this bike around because uh, we, we, we do some riding together yep. here and there and uh, we're gonna be doing a lot more now. Um, there's a ton of more stuff that you're gonna be doing to the bike, which we're not gonna go over now. Right. But I mean, the bike looks amazing. You got the crowd set up on there. You got the Arlen S. Uh, big brake rotors. Big brake rotors. Front and rear. Up. Front and rear. Matching rear. So do we wanna hear it? Yeah. Face was everything right there. You can't, you can't, you Turbos. can't get, you can't get tired of that. Turbos always make people smile. Yeah. Mike, you make me smile. <laughs> <laughs> Late I am to get into my next destination. 
Mike told me that it was his feeder. It was a what? His feeder. Oh yeah. <laughs> So we do have the El Diablo here with this turbo kit. I'm pretty sure you guys are wondering the number one question. What's the number? It's finally here, God damn it! it's finally here. You guys been all asking for it, here you go. The What's the Number t-shirts have finally arrived. You can only get them here at the Tour Custom Cycle Shop. We're doing a limited run first, so it's not that many. So if you really want one, pass by this weekend, pick one up. Call Mike, see if you want to get a few for you and your buddies. Um, we're going to be doing this limited run. So if you want one, come get it. Do we even know the numbers of this bike yet? No. What's the numbers? We don't know. Not yet, right? No. We will know soon.